Right folks, as you can see, she is running. There is a couple of leaks, slight leaks. One, uh, both at the end cap, slightly there, and a bit further around the other side, so I'll break out the soldering iron for that shortly. Running now, didn't want to go to start with, but it just seemed to be uh, running better. Obviously not as fast as it ought to be with those two leaks, but running quite well. So basically all I've done is give it a clean up. Resold the, the fitting for the whistle, that's a new whistle. Attempted to resold the end cap, which almost is almost successful. I touched up the soldering on the fitting there as well for the safety valve. There's a new O ring on the top of the safety valve. There's a new O ring on the water level plug. Um, it took two attempts to solder the fitting for the water level plug because while I was attempting to refit the end cap, I unsoldered the plug. Sorted it in the end by putting the boiler in the fridge for a bit to cool down and then warm up the end cap. Um, and that did work, second attempt. Uh, I also added a bit more solder around the rim. Obviously not quite enough in these at this area and that area. But um, I suppose it hasn't flew off the end so that's a good thing. So we'll let it run its course and then we'll uh, attend to those leaks. Very quiet runner. Right folks, um, put a bit of solder there and almost the same place to the side. Cleaned up a little bit but not finished yet but it is, does seem to be holding. As you've already seen by now, it goes like the clappers. More clockwise as we are viewing it now than anti-clockwise. Having said that, I struggled to get to start uh, before, and the, the mess is nearly out, it's going nicely, but I struggled to get to start anti-clockwise and I'm messing and it, and it started on its own and it's been going really nice, we'll say really slow now, but smooth, because the mess is, well, about like a candle at the moment, so not bad. Does, um, more so than the other one, does tend to fill up in the exhaust um, quite easily. But um, I think uh, that's got it now. So um, I'll run it a few times and uh, clean it all up again. And uh, not bad, uh, I think um, about 10 quid for the whistle. The uh, adapter for the air fitting, to run it on air, is not the right size. Um, and my soldering is a little bit, uh, well it don't get much better but that's no surprise. But not bad for a freebie and uh, several hours work and uh, a few spares. Hello again folks, this is the second full firing. You can see the safety valve is uh, kicking off uh, nicely. And she's uh, not leaking anywhere other than that, where of course it should do. But I can see. Going anti-clockwise, not as fast, but very, very smooth. Especially if you use the steam oil on all the pivots. I have been using a slightly lighter oil. It seems to be picking up nicely now anyway. Plus the flame's got a little bit of a dousing, but uh, not too bad. But in more importantly, just keeping an eye. There doesn't seem to be any leaks. I've cleaned it up a little bit when I've done the repairs. Um, but I'm obviously it's getting a bit sooty now. I'm going to give it several runs and uh, hopefully it'll be fine. And uh, then it's uh, going to be leaving the collection. But hopefully to promote the hobby. It seems the problem with the slower speed going anti-clockwise is down to the operating lever going a bit too far. If I just touch it, it takes off like a good one. Indeed. If I go the other way, 
it takes off anyway. And it starts to dance around the room, so it's just standing still. No. <laughs> As you can see it goes very well. Hmm, interesting. Anybody got any ideas why that's uh, running it too far? Maybe the pin needs a bit of adjustment. I think I like it at the slower speed. Sounds like a BSA single, gold star. <laughs> I think there's a bit too much play in the in the, uh, in the pin there, so I'll check that. Seems like there's a bit too much play in the pivot that the uh, leader pivots on. Very lanky. Hmm. Let's have a look at that when it's cooled down. This is running quite nicely here. Yeah? There's no leaks and that's the main thing. 